Oh my god, this smells so nice. It's me. <laughs> oh, hello. Hi cousins, it's Kemi. Welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year again. <laughs> so into this video, I've got 10 of my favorite perfumes that I'm gonna show you guys because you know I wanna put you guys on. Like some of those perfumes. Yeah, okay. These are literally my favorite perfumes like i wear these all the time and my bank account is screaming at me <laughs> but it's fine for like smell it's just such a you know no i feel like if you smell good you feel good and like you just your whole aura just changes especially when people tell you like oh my god this smells so nice it's me <laughs> So right here I have got my normal perfumes, I've got my oil perfumes and they've got a body spray that I use as well. My collection of perfume is, I would say decent, but these are my top all time favourite that I absolutely love and I just want to share it with my lovely cousins. I think I'm going to do body spray first, then oil perfumes, then my alcohol based perfumes. Before we jump into this video, all my perfumes are quite sweet. I like sweet perfumes i don't really like green or green perfumes that's not me i'm on like the more sweeter scent that's the kind of vibes that i like so we're gonna start off with the buddy mess this mess is about a beef for dreams i think every single person would have this like some sort of like a buddy mess at home for like in the bathroom if not this i'm pretty sure we all had the victoria's secret in a buddy mess oh my god i rinsed those out in college oh God. Please don't buy it from the hair shop because the hair shop ones are fake. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I don't really reach for this one. I used to have the vanilla scent. That one I absolutely love. And when I went to go get it, there was none there. So I ended up picking up this one. This one I liked because it was purple and purple is my favorite color. <laughs> and it actually does smell good as well. So I picked this one from Asda. You just can get it from Super Drugs Boots or Asda. Those are the three places I have purchased this brand this one's like a fruity smell like actual fruit like passion fruit i do like body mist but i don't reach for it as much as i do with my perfumes which i should do because it's actually like the most cheapest one here i will strap the bath sometimes i just spray this on it just doesn't last as long but this does the job and it smells good and it smells like fruit and that's what i like next i'm gonna go through some oil perfumes i only have three i do want to increase my collection in this i've been really loving them my three oil perfumes are from a brand called t40 i feel like oil perfumes out of all my perfume collection are the ones that stay the longest on me because there's no alcohol in there and there's no water it's literally just oil i kid you not it will last you for 24 hours like oh my god i am really planning on building up my oil perfumes i have been raving about these as well on my instagram if you follow me on instagram you'll see on my stories that i have honestly been raving about this brand just because i absolutely love the perfumes like it's just amazing so i have the scent angelica delicious oud and ruby ruby has made an appearance on the channel already this ruby scent <laughs> my absolute favorite there's no way i can describe the scent the scent is like seductive if seductive was a scent it will be this ruby like perfume it just screams bedroom it just screams i'm ready i don't know what you're ready for but it just screams i'm ready that's about it that's what i'm gonna say i want to lie to you guys i tend to wear this scent when i want to feel very feminine and very sexy the next one is delicious oud i always say this is like a classic lavender scent if you are really into lavender scent um this will be your best friend because this scent is not as sweet as i like my other scents i tend to put this in my oil diffuser <sighs> when i tell you my room smells so good let me show you guys what i mean so this is my oil diffuser that i have in my room so what i like to do is to add my water and put the oil in this little thing for the oil honestly like the best thing ever my whole room smells so freaking good and then the next thing that i picked up is angelica this one i do wear out but this one is really strong all of this oil perfumes by the way are really strong this one angelica i think is the strongest out of these two that i have the ruby one i've worn out before the angelica one i wear out because it's like a fresh scent i also put some of this one in my oil diffuser as well make my room smell really good 
yeah I do have other ones that i've had my eyes on that i do want to try out okay let's move on to alcohol and water base perfumes okay so we're going to start off with c by jojo armani if you don't have this baby girl what are you doing <laughs> oh my gosh this perfume absolute delish bloody love this perfume so freaking much if you like like vanilla flower and like sweet mix them together this is for you this is like a i'm grown but playful type of vibe oh i just love it next is bloom by gucci my friend actually got this for my birthday camilla shout out to you girl this one's a very floral scent whenever i wear this scent i feel grown and elegant i just feel like don't look at me don't touch me don't talk to me because i'm that i don't know if it's just me but do you guys ever wear perfumes that you just feel like a whole different person <laughs> i feel like it just gives you like a whole different vibe whenever i wear this i just feel grown sexy this is one of my less sweet scents this is more like my green floral side if you're not into sweet like a really sweet scent and more fresh more elegant more you know i don't have the words but yeah if you're into that um this one might be perfect for you glad that i had this in my collection just to you know give me a different type of vibe okay next let's go for a classic that i feel like everyone would have at home this is the ysl black opal spray i'm pretty sure we all know this smell we all love it first of all i don't know why ysl are trying to confuse the girl because you just have to be careful with this perfume because there is so many perfumes that ysl have done and they're all called black opal but they have different scents which is so like annoying like is you dumb my tiny little brain can't handle all of the stress okay <laughs> So YSL, can you please change your bottles at least or change the name? I feel like this is one of my strongest perfume. A little goes a really long way with this one. I still seem to find myself buying three bottles a year. I kid you not, this is a new bottle. Absolutely love this. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Absolutely love this. Okay, so another favorite of mine from YSL is this perfume. I mean, let me get the name out for you guys. Okay, so this is the YSL Mon Paris The Perfume. Okay, I'm just gonna put the names on this screen because I'm not trying to butcher the names at all. This, another favorite of mine, I've gone through bottles of this. This is just so sweet and this makes me feel, oh, it's like bubblegum mixed with like flour, mixed with like vanilla. It's a really, really sweet scent. This perfume makes me feel really good, really girly and just edible, like eat me now. Okay, maybe don't. Next is another YSL perfume. I recently just started using this and I am loving it. I've got the travel size one because obviously I didn't want to commit. This is the YSL Libre perfume. This is not as sweet as this one. This is more on like the, again, I'll put this in like my grown, elegant vibe type of, um, type of perfume. This perfume gives me like richness vibes, like elegant richness, you know, classy vibes i absolutely love it i don't know i can't believe i was sleeping on this now i'm gonna get the full bottle this is not gonna last me at all if you want that elegant rich vibes i recommend this for yourself and then last but not least is my Givenchy perfume this out of my alcohol based perfumes i feel like this is the perfume that i get the most compliment on i tend to wear this when i'm going out out this is like everything in one for me in any type of movement i'm in this compliments it it's very feminine it's very elegant it's very sweet when i wear this perfume i don't spray anything else on like this perfume by itself does it for me this is the one that i don't really like sharing with people but because we're cousins i'll share it with you guys okay i'll put you guys on i'll put you guys on like this is me in a bottle this is just yeah i go for perfume so much that my bank account wants to kill me <laughs> These are my top three that I repurchase like maybe twice or three times a year. Look, I've got empty bottles of them just laying around in the house that I need to like get rid of. That is pretty much it. These are my top 10 favorite scents that I love personally for myself. A little side note, I do like to mix my perfume together. So you will never see me just wearing one perfume by itself. I think that might be the reason why I ran out of perfumes really quickly. 
hmm, and stop doing that. I just like pairing scents together. The only one I avoid pairing together is this one's my Givenchy one because I just like this one by itself. Yeah, so this is the end of the video, cousins. I'm always looking for new scents, so let me know your favorite perfumes so then I can, you know, go purchase it too <laughs> and copy you. And let me know which one would you like to try in this video as well down below. Let's have a conversation, okay? Thank you, cousins, so much for watching. I love and appreciate you guys so much. You guys already know that. Inshallah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, cousins. <laughs>